there was a sucker punch. CBS Austin morning meteorologist Avery Tomasco still seems a little shaken up by this punch caught on dash cam video this week. He said one sentence with an obscenity in there. Um, you hit my blank car and I replied no, you hit my car, and that's when he swung with his entire force. Just moments before that, I'm da -da. it was a normal I'm afternoon. Not. He was driving on Mopac at Steck. All of a sudden, there's a car coming into my lane. I slam on the horn, hit the brakes, but it's unfortunately too late at that point. Even then, Avery says he didn't think it was a big deal. It's a, a, a minor collision at that point. But the driver kept driving until Avery says he got his attention and they pulled into the shopping center at Capital of Texas. Texas Highway and 183. And we pull into the shopping center as casual as anything possible. Um, we're using blinkers, we're going slowly. Avery didn't suspect anything at this point, but a spokesperson for AAA Texas says there's a good reason to be wary in these situations. According to the AAA Foundation for Traffic Safety, uh, this was done in 2019, uh, nearly 80% of drivers express significant anger, aggression, or road rage behind the wheel at least once uh, in the prior 30 days. Avery began to take pictures of the damage when the other driver is seen approaching him on video with his fists. That little bit that he did wind up, I guess, was, a, was enough for my brain to realize you're in danger. <laughs> move your neck. Both men move out of frame and Avery is heard calling for help. That's when he says the other driver walked away. Exactly. If you are confronted, stay as calm and courteous as possible. And if you, uh, again, feel threatened, call 911. What well, AAA suggests you do. When police arrived, they took the report and a copy of the video. There is now a warrant out for the other man's arrest. As for Avery, Did you catch the license plate? he plans to press charges and he says the dash cam video will help him prove it. Video is everything that there's there's no disputing video evidence, both with the crash and both with what he did to me after the fact.